Hi, Sharon Vaughn, University of Texas. I'm here to talk a little more about integrated versus isolated skill development. This time I'm talking about how this could be done with older students who are advancing their reading in text. And the most important goal of reading, of course, is reading comprehension. We want students to understand and learn what they read. But one of the ways to do that is to advance their uh, integrated comprehension through listening, reading, and writing. So for example, if you're working on main idea or inference making, two of the powerful comprehension skills, in addition to teaching them in isolation, for example, what is the most important word in this paragraph? What are some of the important words that support that essential word? What's the main idea? We also ask students about main idea when we're reading more advanced text to them, perhaps expository text, and we then ask the question, stop, what's the main idea? What's this mostly about? Furthermore, we allow students to practice that main idea skill when they're doing content area learning. So we may be teaching a construct in science, and we ask students, let's stop and write the main idea about what we've been talking about with respect to this science unit. So for example, integrated skills takes a target area, such as reading comprehension, and within that target area, such as main idea, and provides opportunities throughout the day to integrate that throughout the literacy and content area instruction.